Hey, what's going on everyone? So I'm going to have to do a voiceover for this part of the video because I went back and watched it and it was super, super boring because I stayed monotone like the whole time and I said I was going to pick up this bed and I'm going to go and yeah, it was really boring. So I'm taking the bed back because I felt that it was wrong to steal it and I should, there's a way for me to make wool that's somewhat vegan. So I'm going to just re re put the bed back where I got it from and make my own bed. And right now in this clip, I'm looking for the house to put it back in the same house. I don't know, just to be a nice guy. But yeah, I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do to get wool? I have to kill spiders. I know it's an animal, but still, it's a hostile mob. If if I don't kill it, it's gonna kill me, and that wouldn't be too fun to just die like right away. So I'm gonna kill spiders, and it takes four wool to or four wool, four string to make one block of wool and then three wool is used to make a bed on top of obviously the wood slab or yeah wood planks slabs what is it yeah uh planks no yep planks so i'm gonna be traveling a lot because i feel like i also should not stay here because i'm like ashamed of myself for stealing their bed and not doing it the correct way so i'm like i'm gonna just go and travel and see if i can find a new place to call home Still traveling. Hey, look, I'm Aquaman. I have enough materials to make a bed, so I just wanted to put it on screen or show it on screen that I'm making the bed. One, two, three. Oh my god! Oh my god! What the hell? Seriously? Well, too bad this stupid coronavirus has the damn hospital closed because I almost went there for a freaking heart attack. Holy crap. Ooh, that scared the...
All right, everyone. I think we finally found a place to call home and set up our base, our starter base, I guess. And it's pretty cool because it's right here next to a ravine and it goes pretty deep and there, I see some iron right away and everything. So I'm gonna set up a house and chop some more wood down and start gathering materials. And then we're gonna go down and start mining in the ravine. So yeah, hopefully we can get a bunch of iron because I want to make some more tools and a bunch of other, like another bucket. So I could have a bucket for water, bucket for lava. Don't laugh because this is not going to be very pretty at all. It's going to be a really small, basic little shelter to hide all of my inf inventory so I have somewhere to put it. And once we get done with this, we're going to head into the ravine and try to look for some more iron and maybe some more gold. I don't know. We'll see what we find. All right, so let's get this started. Let's go down and start getting a little pathway going to go down here. So that way we can start our little mine. Um, mine, what's it called? A, like a quarry, I guess you'd call it. Yeah, that's a quarry. So, so far this has been whoa a journey and kind of crazy that i'm able to do this and they made it possible to like to like live off like eating like little plants and stuff like you don't have to eat it's not like required to eat the animals and stuff like that you know pretty cool i think it's pretty cool lets you do options like this where you can play like challenge yourself to do like a vegan or even like whatever vegetarian you can call it you know. but yeah let's try to make a little pathway down here i just wanted to get, i just want to clear up all that uh dirt so that way it's like not i don't know it was kind of an eyesore i felt like but let's get down closer so any gaze any gaze anyways not gaze how are you guys doing let me know in the comments below. Just want to hang out and talk. Be cool to reply to some of your comments if there's any comments or anything. I don't know. Be fun to get to know whoever's a few people watching. It's kind of hard to do all this because I don't really know what to talk about. That's the hard thing. It's like, because I don't have an audience or anything built up yet, so it's not like I can, like, reply in these videos to something that I talked about last video or anything, you know? So it's, like, kind of awkward. I just sound like a crazy person talking to myself. And so if someone heard me, they'd be like, what the heck are you doing, dude? Why are you just, like, talking to yourself? You're so weird. I don't know. But, yeah. I guess I can talk a little bit about myself, maybe. That way... People are curious on what I do or why I decided to do this or anything. I don't know. Any reason, really. So, obviously, to even know anything about this, I'm vegan. So, yeah, it's just, um, I don't know. I just, I was reading about the benefits. Like, I've been vegan for a while now, for about, how long? Let's say, since last May. So, May of 2019. I became vegan and um yeah it was really hard at first to be honest because like i like how my family i was raised like uh, in the morning we'd have like on the weekends we have chorizo and egg and burritos and potato you know and we'd always have like barbecue and like ribs and steaks and stuff and yeah i don't know like and then when i moved into our rental home with my fiance it just like for some reason like i was having like a lot of like digestive issues and it just like clicked to me and i'm just like well honestly every time i have like ice cream or like what's it called uh cereal or something every time i had something like that i would get a really bad stomach ache so i was like i was wondering why so i was like doing like a lot of googling and stuff and like found out that it's like a lot of it's like a common thing to be allergic to like dairy and to me that was like 
totally new. Like, I never knew anything about that. I was like, okay, what the heck? Like, so I was like, well, what's, what has dairy? Like, like, I know obviously milk is dairy and stuff like, but like, I was like looking and I was like, cheese. Oh, wow. Cheese is, is like full of, it's all dairy. I didn't know that. Like, it was just like, I'd never really put any thought into like what actually has dairy and what's made with milk. And that led to like a whole, like, oh, wow. Like I looked at everything and like pretty much everything I was e eating, like had milk. It was like, can contains milk contains eggs it's just like all kinds of crazy stuff so it's like so i tried from what was it from them oh hey look a creeper come on buddy let's go blow you up out here i'm not trying to mess up a part of my cave over here double up oh yeah dang it Oh, well, he didn't do too much damage. Well, I'm actually gonna probably just mend that up. But yeah, in, um, in the May, so May's, or not May, uh, December of 20, what was it? 2018, I would say. Yeah, December of 2018 is when I started to just, like, not, try not to eat dairy. So it's like, for a while, I was, we we're buying, like, all the, like, the, we we're pretty much eating like I wouldn't want to say vegetarian because we we're still eating meat and chicken and stuff, but it's like we were just yeah, like pretty much just like cut out dairy. That's all we did, honestly. And so since cutting out dairy, like I was like doing so much better and everything, and then I started like because ever since I was little, I've had these issues, and then I've also been since like maybe what like six. Six or seven i've been I was, i've been heavy so it's like i've been heavy set you know and so i started to take like well okay well if these if this dairy issue is causing me to like have digestive problems like i wonder if it's adding on to like why i'm so heavy and stuff so i started looking because i honestly i didn't eat like a, it's not like i ate a lot i just i didn't eat for as big as I looked you know you know what I'm saying it's kind of hard to say that and so I just it didn't click to me so I started like researching and stuff and then and all this was going on from a life or from a span of December to December 2018 to like April 2019 so in April 20 like late April 2019 we found this um article about a Netflix well not, it's not just Netflix but it was on Netflix when we found it a documentary called what the hell and so we watch oh wow cool there might be some good stuff in here gonna have to go check that out a little bit but oh what's the whole thing I can just open this up and so where was I talking about so yeah, it just, I don't know, it just, we watched it and everything and obviously we got really upset and emotional and like, because it's, it, that documentary is pretty crazy on what it explains and everything, it just makes so much, everything makes so much sense after you watch that and it's just, I don't know, it just like changed the, our way of thinking and everything so we decided to try plant-based, which is, because difference between i the to my understanding the difference between vegan and the difference between plant-based plant-based is just like the diet so not eating any obviously animal products but vegan is just like a way of living it's just a total different lifestyle it's not just the diet it's like str try not to use any animal made products like any leather anything like that and it's trying to cut back on well, what me and my fiance are doing, we're trying to do zero waste. Right now it's kind of hard because we live with uh, my fiance's grandparents because our house is currently getting built. And um, it's kind of hard living with other people. Like they don't understand how you want to, like your way of, the way you want to live. And so we're trying as best as we can. Like when we go to Starbucks, we take our own cup, you know, when we... If we have to use a plastic bag, we try to use it multiple times, not just once and throw it away, you know, it's, it's just, 
a different way of living so it's like that's why i say i'm vegan because i'm doing it not only for my health but for the animals you know oh wow hey a melon why did it grow that way it should have grown this way dang it <sighs> okay anyways so yeah i just felt like i needed to talk about that i don't know i feel like that was an important reason like so that way you guys know why i'm doing this and why it seems like i know more than the average person well not average person just like the normal typical person they don't really know what vegan is and all that you know so it's like that's why i I say in the, when I first started this, I said "quote unquote" vegan because there's obviously some things I have to use, like the leather, like the animal pro, like so that the animal made products in this game. So it's kind of hard because it's like some things are forced and some aren't. So luckily, like this, the bread isn't forced, so I can just live off bread. And then eventually, I want to start killing some of the mobs, and I can. It's kind of rare, but you can sometimes you can get a carrot or a potato. Like they'll drop it when you kill them, so that'll be like cool to be able to have those extra, those different like a variety, you know. So yeah, like I say, so yeah, a lot. So yeah, so yeah, so yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm weird. Obviously, if you know me in person, then you know I'm weird. Just kidding. Not that weird. Just uh. A little goofy, I guess. So I don't know if I want to make a path. Yeah, like, like I want to. Maybe if I like level all this, like just clear all this out and make it just gradually, like how it's kind of steps right here. Like, yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of all these trees. Let me. I don't have any more. Uh, my axe is gonna break, but I do have. Let me go to bed first, actually, because don't want any mobs to spawn that experience of me running through the desert and everything it just Whew, that is, let's just say that was this sucked what the or melons oh yeah melons set on game mode to survival mode ha! bet you guys thought i cheated on something didn't you nope i actually if you pay attention to the thumbnail that's how i was able to get that view yeah with the creative mode. i don't know i don't feel like there's a reason to cheat like obviously like if i want diamonds just go get it like what's the fun in just like spawning myself in some diamonds or something you know it's i don't know that's just dumb i've seen videos before where people get like accused of like well you use creative to put stuff in your why why would you do that why even make this whole freaking like this um Series. Like, why even do that if you're gonna cheat? Might as well just go make stuff in creative, you know? So it's like, I don't know. We're crazy. Put the coal in there, and I don't need any more melons. Don't need any more dirt. Oh, yeah. Oh, I wanna make this into a blast furnace. Furnace. Let's do that. So, for the blast furnace, what you're gonna need is a furnace regular one and then you need i think is it three or five i think it's maybe five no no it's three yeah it's i think yeah it's three pieces what you're gonna have to do is you put you're gonna have to make smooth stone and to get smooth stone you cook regular cobblestone and you get stone and then when this is done you put it back and let it keep cooking and a piece of smooth stone will come out right Ow! oh okay that was too early yeah smooth stone see and so what you're gonna do is you're gonna put the smooth stone then the furnace and then i think actually you do have to put all that iron i don't know we'll see oh wait in the recipe book. um nope nope and nope Nope, 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 Smoker? Close. Yeah, no. Okay. And then that, and then some iron. Now does it show me the recipe? Come on, I have everything in here for the recipe. Don't do this to me. Really? Okay. Oh. 
Oh, I don't have everything. As I raise my axe. <laughs> now it should show. But I'm going to take a crack at it. See if I remember it correctly. So you do that. That. And that. Nope. That. Yeah. Hey, I kind of remember. So, cool thing about the blast furnace. I don't know if you guys or girls know about this. It's to smelt items quicker. So, uh, I should have compared it. Dang it. Oh well. But you, you saw how slow it did the stone. So watch this. It's going to be spitting in my mouth. Wrong thing. <laughs> yeah, that, that's quick. Okay. I was all waiting. I was like, uh, why isn't it doing anything? But I was like, oh yeah, wrong thing. So we need some... I have some sticks. Okay. What are we going to need? We're going to need another axe. Oh, don't need that many. And we're going to need a shovel because I broke the one we were using. I think we should be good with that. I'll just leave the stuff in my inventory just in case we get a book. We'll let that go. And we'll pick. What do we use for this? X? Why do I have this golden apple on me? I should not carry that on me. Especially right now. Because if I just, like, a creeper comes and just wrecks me. There. Oh, speaking of creeper coming. I wonder. Hmm. I think I have enough arm. I mean, enough uh, iron to make armor. That would be awesome. Hey, look at they okay, got the leggings, which don't know why they call them leggings, but okay. Some boots. Oh yeah, I definitely have enough for this. Chest plate. <laughs> the leather one's called a tunic. That was pretty. Remember seeing that when we were raiding that uh, shipwreck. Suit up. Yeah. So, all right, little ducky, you're gonna be covered in iron yeah now we have some armor so some creepers can try to blow us up and see if they can even try let us let them try that's all i'm saying let them try try me see if you can try to blow me up doubt it okay so let's oh yeah i need to let me clear some of these up felt like when I was talking about vegan I was going with I was going somewhere with it I swear and I just I don't know I started I just start talking about next start talking about something else or something and just totally lost my train of thought hmm. oh yeah but anyways if there's any vegans comment down below let me know down below why you're vegan and and how long you've been vegan and if you enjoy it so far or yeah that'd be cool it'd be cool to meet some new vegans it's always cool when you meet a vegan that actually understands why you do what you do you know i have so many family members that are like for what oh you, how do you live without steak how do you eat how do you not have meat how, how can you not eat meat like really like calm down like they just I don't know, it just seems like when people taunt you like that, it's just like more childish, I feel like. They just, like if that's how I want to live, that's how I want to live. Like, just get off my back, you know? It's really annoying. I remember I had uh, one family member, it was pretty funny, <laughs> throughout Thanksgiving time, or at Thanksgiving, on Thanksgiving, I posted a picture on Facebook of my plate of food. Or no, I didn't. What did I do? I posted something, and one of my cousins, he's like, Oh, enjoy your salad. And I just like, we're like laughing as we're cooking. And then, so I posted a picture of my plate of like vegan food. And I was like, oh, my salad is so amazing. Thank you. I'll enjoy it. And it's just like a bunch of like the gardens, like chicken or not chicken, um, like turkey or what's it called? Yeah, it's like a, it's like a turkey, like a, a roll. It has like inside it had like cranberry, carrots, um, all kinds of vegetables inside around like it's like uh soy or like tofu and then there's like uh, like breadcrumbs and stuff around it and then we also had from the brand field roast they have like a celebration roast or whatever it's like it's like a ham 
and it is so good. And then we made obviously mashed potatoes and used some follow your heart or not follow your heart. Um, uh, what is it called? Earth Balance, the butter. And we made mashed potatoes, and then what else did we make? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Um, and we had rolls, I think, and they're like the anti aunties, aunties, the potato rolls. You can; those are vegan, so we had those on the side. It was it was really good. We're gonna plan. We're gonna have that again this year in 2020. And actually, my um, person that was really skeptical about it was my mom and I would talk to her about it because she's been on like keto and same same situation as me just been heavy m most of her life and everything and just so she's been trying all kinds of diets and stuff and overall and she saw like I like was dropping weight pretty like quick like well, not quick but I was just like like I wasn't dropping weight quick like the like the actual pounds numbers it's just you can tell like by looking at me like that I was losing weight like and, and it was like it kept changing and came, it kept going like it's not like I just one week I looked different and then I kept and that's it I stayed like that for a while like I was like for like a couple months like it was like changing 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 like because I was going to the gym every single day and we were eating clean we weren't eating like the vegan junk food like all the soy products and stuff what can you besides oh no besides like as a defense, what do you do with those? I don't feel like you can eat them. But yeah, like we weren't eating any like vegan junk food. We we're eating clean whole foods, you know. And like I dropped weight, like good, like not like these, like decent, you know. And um, so she's like, "How did you do that?" You know. And I told her about vegan and not eating meat. And she's like, "Oh no, I cannot live without eating meat. I can't do this. Oh no, look, you know, exaggeration, childish, freaking." Oh no, I can't do that. Oh no, I, I've been eating like this for whole my life, I, my whole life. I can't do that, you know. It's just, and so I got that from her for a long time, like I mean a long time, for like two months. I heard her just, she just kept going and going and wouldn't give in. She wouldn't just try it, you know. And so I even showed her the document or sent her the, the name of the documentary, and she has Netflix, so she looked it up, and she watched it, and she still was the aunt about it like she still she's like oh well how's that is that stuff true is it like i was like yes obviously it's, it's like there's some parts where they can exaggerate in it but then but for most of it it's straight up facts for the year it was made it's like it's like you look up the stuff now and it's all like taken down like the stuff that they pointed out in the documentary it's pretty crazy but um yeah so she finally decided to go vegan and and now that I, we're me and my fiance we are vegan. She's vegan, and my fiance's grandparents actually don't mind eating like vegan food. Like it tastes like like they like it. Like they're not bothered by. It. They're like not like ew, oh my god, it's vegan, gross. You know, it's they they enjoy it. Like every time, uh, my fiance's nana she uh, when I make, we make something and so oh can I try it or or how does it how did it come out and I'm like oh you want to try it here take a bite like try it out. And she always like, oh, it's good, it's good. Like she's always like positive about it. And so I feel like this year, we're, our house, with well, with everything going on, I don't know now, but our house was supposed to be done. Yeah, yeah, we we're um the time of my the time of me recording this, like literally, our house is supposed to close in a week. Yeah, in a, in about a week, and um. I'll throw up a picture real quick right here. And this is the current situation of it. So I don't think they are gonna finish in a week. I don't know, maybe, I, it could be possible. I don't know, I'm not a contractor, but I don't know. <laughs> they they did all the drywall inside and they put all the, I don't know what it's called. If you know what it's called, please put it down in the comments. But in between, like when they put the drywall up, or like to cover up the the holes from the screws and this, and to like seal the the cracks in between each dry, piece of drywall, whatever that's called, put it comment it down below, please, because I don't even know how to Google that. I tried googling it before, and it just yeah, <laughs> couldn't figure out anything. 
All right, let's finish up this uh, pathway. Uh, man, I want this to look more natural though. This looks like, eh, you know? Like it looks like I obviously made a freaking staircase here. It's not natural looking, I don't like it. So I'm gonna try to open this up a little bit and see what we can do with this. Because it's kind of weird. So I need to probably add in. Man, I think all seriously, I think I'm gonna end up coming up from the path. Like if I make it how I want to, so I want to do slabs. I don't like stairs. I just it's it's like all like on the screen it looks like bumpy, like you're going up and down a roller coaster, you know. So it's like. I want to do slabs because it's a nice smooth transition. It's not like boom, 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 you know? So I think if I do slabs, it's going to like slowly, it's going to go up slow. So I think I'm going to pop up like when I surface, it's going to be like over here. So I think I'm going to have to hurry up and clear all these trees out. So let's get going on that. And I don't know what else I can talk about. Hmm. Or I could talk about what I do for work, I guess. Yeah, that'd be cool. So for work, I do medical billing, A typical nine to five job, you know. But um, yeah. So when the like you go to the hospital and the doctors see you, or just the doctor's office and they see you, and they send money or they send the they see you and they charge you for it, obviously, right? Not you directly, but if you have insurance, what I do is I send it to the insurance and get it paid for. And then when you make payments at, like, a doctor's office, I do, like, the processing of that and stuff. It's pretty cool. Some doctor's offices do it in-house, but we are a third-party company. So we... Like a lot of the physicians, they bring us their stuff, and then we do it, and then we send it from our office to whoever it needs to go to <laughs> so yeah, yeah it's kind of pretty boring to be honest but uh cool thing is it's the reason we're able to get our house so it doesn't matter if it's boring or not oh oops wrong key yeah so it doesn't matter if it's <laughs> boring or not it pays the bills you know it's pretty cool though i'm I'm glad we're me and my fiance are getting our own house because we're i don't know if I guess it's kind of like the new, like, normal. But I heard a creeper. <laughs> I don't know if it's the new normal, but, like, my fiance is 23, I'm 24, and we're getting, we're purchasing our first home, you know? So, pretty cool. Pretty exciting. I feel like we're really young to be even doing, to do that, you know? It's, usually I feel like people are, like, in their 30s when they buy their first home. I don't know. It's just maybe the, my culture, because I'm Hispanic, but I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> that makes sense, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm. I don't speak any Spanish, and I just I don't know. You see, like the typical Hispanic household, it's like the kids stay at their parents' house until they're like sometimes thirty, unless they meet like a spouse, and obviously they move out earlier. But if not, they're usually if they're like single and just like dating people, they're usually still at their parents' home until they're like pretty much until they meet someone. <laughs> so if it takes someone a long time to meet somebody. Uh, I feel bad for you. <laughs> but yeah, we we did have our rental. We moved in parkour. Parkour. Just kidding. I like the office. It's where that's from. Nobody knows. If you know, you know. Wait for president. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, I just feel like we're pretty young for our age to be able to even get it. I'm just really happy and stuff. So doing something right, you know. When you're accomplishing your goals earlier than you expect you're doing something right okay well these trees are cleared out I keep hearing mobs like right in this like general area because even when I go down here they're like in the wall I, I feel like you know what I bet you that little uh I bet you that's a separate cave you know what I'm gonna build a bridge to that that'd be cool so since we're in the spruce forest, I, oh, second, sorry. <laughs> I feel that it's like, 
I don't want to say like period correct, like because that's like time period, but it's like it's uh I don't know how to say it, but it makes sense to use spruce wood for our stuff that we're gonna build around here. And I'll just do that. I don't need all of that. There we go. Why isn't it? Boom! Did it not need that bitty? Dang it! Oh well. Crap. <laughs> What do, well, I'm gonna make. I'm actually. I'm lying because I'm gonna need more than that because I'm gonna need a bunch of slabs to go all the way down. So yeah, they're gonna get used. Not like I'm wasting them. I'm not wasting wood. I promise. <laughs> oh, come on, reach. Yeah. Whatever. I just needed to get here so I can. There we go. Um, is that gonna look funny? Is that gonna look funny? Oh no! Nope. There we go. Uh, how does that look? That looks stupid. To be honest. Let's try this. Yeah, so three and make this three wide. So let's do that. And make this three wide. Then we'll take this all the way here. I don't know, I feel like that looks weird. More like that. And that looks better, I think. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna take this out. Oh, that would suck. Oh, I have a shovel, duh. Okay. Here, 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 here. La 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 la. Okay. Not gonna sing. I don't wanna bust your eardrums out if you're wearing headphones. Sorry. Dang it. Okay. Back to bed because I do not want mobs to spawn. And let's go back out here. I don't know. I feel like this looks weird. It does. It does look weird. Let me take these sides off. I wonder if it'll look better without the sides. See, like, leave it like that. And then take this one off. And then maybe put that one. And that one. And I don't know. This, maybe like that. And then... Maybe that looks better. And then this I'll just go. I know I messed up on that. Oh well. Give me that. And then just go one more. Nope, that's gonna bother me. Nope, nope, not about that. Yep, X. That would be a piece of grass. Okay, I feel like that looks better. Yeah, 100% better. I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to trim this back. I don't like how it's... Right here, how it's so thin of a pathway. And I think I'm going to do this too right here. Jeez, I hear something. I swear it's like a creeper again. I'm like scarred since earlier when I was on the, that stupid island. 
Yeah, I should have came and lit this up first. Before I started building a bridge. Yeah, that's a lit path to nowhere. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, I feel like this looks a little better. I think I'm actually gonna shave this and make it. Do I have enough though? Yeah, I think I have enough. I'm building a bridge. There. Cool. I feel like that's a little nicer looking. I hope. And do that. And then later, when I can. Well, I can do it now, but wait till I develop this area a little bit better. When I can make some lanterns, I can make like a little cool like light pole and put a lantern on each side. I feel like I should do that right now, but I don't want to waste all my iron in case I need tools. But I'm going to do this for temporary. I don't want to hit this because I don't know. It's like in Minecraft when you like hit update a block around like sand or gravel, it just like... <laughs> goes down and I don't want it to like mess up what I'm doing down there so I'm gonna leave it I don't know how I'm gonna be able to do this I think I'm gonna have to because this is cool right here I can just like with this leave that just natural how it is and just do like that and like that yeah. just Bam, bam. Oh, that's not gonna work. See, I already run into problems. I'm gonna have to trim back stuff. I'm gonna have to go bam, 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 bam. Yeah. So I just need to do that and then do dink, dink, dink. And then I'm gonna have to do that all the way up. Yeah, I'm gonna use a lot of spruce logs. That is so annoying, all the mobs in there like crying to get out but they don't want to come out because then they're gonna die because I'm gonna kill them completely in the vegan <laughs> yeah you guys are like yeah right <laughs> okay so let's make a lot oh not that don't want to cook nothing do that bam right there Right there, and right there. So, I'm gonna do. How many do you think that's gonna be? How many stacks? Huh? 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 Whoa! Sorry, I knocked over a pencil thing. That's a lot. <laughs> but I bet you I'm gonna use all of these. How much am I bet? Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to. Maybe not. We'll see. Uh, so cringy having those freaking mobs there. I should have like pushed this back further. So, like, not as long as I can still get up. And that's gonna. What I'm gonna do is put these in my offhand. <laughs> so I don't have to keep switching back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So that's natural right there. Or yeah, I forgot. That. I have to trim this back. Hey. Yeah, this is gonna go like a steep, steep incline. Or not steep, like a. It's gonna. I'm gonna end up way down there over on the other side of the world. <laughs> Wonder if I can do it like that. And just get rid of this part. Yeah, that looks cool. Yeah, yeah. Do that. And then the fun part. Going up. <laughs> I don't even know how I'm going to do this. It's just... uh, not going to be. I need to hurry up because this is going to be a long episode and it's going to be boring because I'm talking a lot. And... I don't want to do just cobblestone though, it looks funny. Oh, there we go. That looks done. Oh well. 
And then what I'm gonna do is just Okay, well I just I did a a natural or a natural looking like pathway down. I'm just gonna go up but in the pattern that I wanna do. It's regular staircase looking. I'm not gonna try to make it look super fancy because it's gonna that can literally take a whole like hour episode if I do that. That can take a long time. Yeah, it's gonna take a while if I do that. I can't put a step right there because it's gonna go up funny. Get you, cows. I got you. And so like, I can go up one. And then I gotta let it skip one. And then I gotta go up because I can't. I can't put another one right here because then I want to be able to go up. So I gotta. Ah! Razor. So I gotta do that. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. I think I'm just gonna zoom through this because this is gonna take a long time. gonna try to curve it this way because I feel like it's no it'll look a little better I feel and I'm gonna take these out of my offhand because I know I'm gonna end up messing up placing some down let me see where's some dirt oh wait it would have made more sense to put dirt here instead of this cobblestone because it's already we're like in the dirt like level, so it wouldn't make sense to call us. Okay. Let's dig out right Almost there. It's gonna look a little better. And then just dig out. Oh, I grew quick. <laughs> I ran a piece of grass. And just do that last piece. And that should be good. There we go. And then I'll just kind of, what do you call it? Um, uh, what is it called? What is it called? What is it called? Um, dang it. What is that called when like you're like forming the landscape like different? I don't know. I don't know what they call it. Put it down in the comments if you know what I'm talking about. A lot of other like Minecraft YouTubers use this. Terraforming. Haha! <laughs> I knew I was gonna think of it. Yeah. Uh did some like light terraforming. Maybe I'll There you go, that looks kinda Natural looks. Broke a shovel again. Yeah, that looks kind of like natural, like goes there. Obviously, when the grass grows, it'll look better. And all this, all this, the grass will grow eventually. Yeah, that looks cool. So I think that's gonna be it for this episode. I did what I said. Built a path down, so we can literally run all the way up and all the way down. This would look so much better if I put more. Oh, not that. That does not look good. It looks weird. I feel like if I just finish, I have enough slabs, more than enough. But I feel like if I go all the way against the wall with all of these, 
gonna look neat. Okay, except, well, I don't know, right here maybe, too? And right here. That looks cool. Okay, and this I'm not gonna mess with yet because I still gotta mine and all that, yeah. And there's this big old gaping hole that we're gonna have to explore. Heard you. I knew I heard you. Heard you, and you can't get to me. Hehe. <laughs> Loser. Freaking green turd. Okay. Yeah, so this is gonna be it for the episode. I made a bridge. Didn't plan on doing that, but I did it. And made this pathway. Gonna have to light it up next episode and possibly go do some mining. So. I feel like that's up. That goes. Like, I feel like we go up weird right here. I wonder if that'll make it feel better. I feel like that would, yeah, that's, yeah, that's better. Okay. So that's going to be up for today. If you liked the video, leave a comment down below. Leave a like. Or if you, even if you didn't like the video, leave a comment down below and let me know what I did wrong. And what I can do to do, or what I can do to make the videos better. So yeah. I'll see you guys next time.